You can literally grow taller at any age, even when you are sleeping. You are probably thinking, how is that even possible? But have you ever wondered why some people just keep growing, while others stop, even though they eat right, exercise, and try all the height hacks? Here's the truth no one talks about. Just keep watching. Your body grows when you are sleeping, and it is dependent on the three circles of growth, and missing even one of this stage could cost you the height you could have had. I'm not just gonna tell you the secret to growth, but also show you the scientific researches that proves this phenomenon. The first circle of growth, slow wave sleep. There's a phase in your sleep called slow wave sleep, also known as deep sleep, and this is where the growth happens. Your brain slows down, your body enters repair mode, and most importantly, your pituitary gland releases a massive surge of human growth hormone, HGH. And HGH is literally what tells your bones and muscles to grow. According to a study published in the Journal of Clinical Endocrinology and Metabolism, up to 70% of daily HGH is secreted during deep sleep. Andrew Huberman also talks about slow wave sleep in his podcast. Growth hormone is released every night when you go to sleep and it's released in the early part of sleep during so-called slow wave sleep. If you're not getting enough deep sleep, your body just won't produce enough HGH, no matter how much you train, eat, or stretch. Another study in neuroendocrinology letters even found that poor sleep quality in teens leads to delayed growth spurts, especially in males, because without hitting those slow wave stages, your growth hormones stay suppressed. Which brings us to the next point, the second circle of growth, the circadian rhythm. Your body runs on a 24-hour internal clock called the circadian rhythm. It controls when you feel sleepy, when your hormones are released, and when your body recovers. And here's the kicker. Human growth hormone, HGH, follows this rhythm very strictly. A study in Frontiers in Neuroendocrinology shows that HGH peaks shortly after you fall asleep, but only if your sleep aligns with your natural circadian rhythm. So when's the best time to sleep if you want to grow? Part 1. Quantity of Sleep The Golden Window for Height Ideally, you want to be asleep by 10.30 p.m. Because studies show that HGH secretion peaks between 10 p.m. and 2 a.m. And the largest spike happens within the first deep sleep cycle. Miss this window, and your growth potential literally fades into thin air. That's why sleep isn't just about how long you sleep. It's when you sleep that truly matters. Part two, the quality of sleep. Blue lights. Every time you stare at your phone before bed, you're sending your brain a fake signal. Hey, it's still daytime. That's because blue light, the one blasting from your screens, suppresses melatonin, the hormone that tells your brain it's time to sleep. Research in the Journal of Pineal Research shows that melatonin, the sleep hormone that regulates your circadian rhythm, directly triggers growth hormone release at night. But exposure to blue light from your phone or laptop can suppress melatonin by up to 80%. So instead of growing, your brain thinks it's daytime and delays HGH secretion. Without melatonin, you don't enter deep sleep. And if you don't enter deep sleep, you don't release HGH. A Harvard study found that blue light suppresses melatonin twice as much as other light frequencies and shifts your circadian rhythm by up to three hours which means one hour of screen time before bed can kill your entire growth cycle. Fix it by turning on night shift or blue light filters at least two hours before bed, wearing blue light blocking glasses, or better shutting off screens one hour before sleep and switching to a book or journaling. Sleeping posture. Here's something most people ignore. Posture during sleep. If you're sleeping curled up like a shrimp or on your stomach, your spine is under pressure. And what's worse, you're waking up shorter than when you went to bed. Gravity compresses your spine all day long, but at night, it's your chance to decompress and regain that lost millimeter or two. And if you are familiar with the term bone space hacking, which I have discussed in my previous video, we want to create micro fractures and then stretch to increase the space between the fractures and growth plates, which will be eventually filled by newer bone cells and eventually making your bones longer. But remember, without the correct sleeping posture, you are just wasting the potential growth that could have been triggered during sleep.
Try this instead. Sleep on your back with a pillow under your knees, best for spine alignment. Or sleep on your side with a pillow between your legs. Avoid thick pillows that push your neck forward. That's a recipe for spinal misalignment in a stunted posture. Now that we have covered the two most important circles of growth, without this last phase, no amount of sleep will help grow you even a single inch. This is like the final key to the system, which signals your body to grow taller and longer. The third circle of growth, nutrition. It is clear by now that your body grows while you sleep, not while you're awake. And to fuel that growth, it needs the right nutrients right before you enter deep sleep. What you eat will directly affect your height. So what should you eat? Think of it like this. Low insulin, high amino acids, and steady release nutrients. Before I tell you what to eat, first I'll tell you what to not eat. Avoid caffeine even six hours before bed. They are circulating in your body for longer than you might think. Sugary foods or drinks. Insulin spikes reduce HGH. And the last is alcohol. Now what you should eat. Try all of these foods, which will help you sleep deeper and produce more. HGH. Almonds and walnuts, loaded with magnesium and melatonin. A warm glass of milk contains tryptophan and calcium for relaxation. Pumpkin seeds or cashews, natural zinc for bone growth. L-glutamine and L-arginine, if you're supplementing, can spike HGH by up to 70%, according to a study published in Amino Acids Journal. These will not only help your sleep and production of HGH, but also boost nutritional supply to your bones, which will help you grow even more. Pro tip, don't eat heavy meals before bed. Keep it light, keep it clean. Final tip, going to bed at the same time every night might sound boring, but for your height, it's pure gold. Your body runs on rhythms. The more regular your schedule, the easier it is to enter deep sleep, release HGH, and repeat the cycle. Even skipping just one night of good sleep can reduce your growth hormone levels by up to 30%, according to clinical trials. So stop playing height lottery with your sleep schedule. Set a fixed bedtime, even on weekends, and stick to it. Because your body doesn't grow in the gym or in the mirror, it grows quietly when no one's watching. There you have it, a full in-depth guide on sleep optimization. These videos takes a lot research and efforts in making, so please like, comment, share,